I'm here with Megan Bennell. Glad you could make it. Thank you for having me. Tell us all about you. Well, I am originally from Caledon, Ontario, which is sort of horse and farm country. Um, I grew up there, and that's where I started to sort of teach myself instruments out of a lack of better things to do. Listen, I used to live, I used to live in Grand Valley. <laughs> I know say, exactly you know. what you're talking about. Yeah. I have family out there. Um, so that's, yeah, that's when I started to, to play the piano, teach myself by ear. And uh, eventually I came to attend the University of Toronto and was in a band at the time and started playing around town a lot. And um, that's sort of all where, where it really began, just playing a ton of shows and really getting into the, the music scene down here. So what are you doing now? I am currently um, just doing music mostly. I, would you consider yourself a singer-songwriter? Would you consider yourself? Yeah, I would say along the lines of singer-songwriter. Um, yeah, I am a solo musician. I do all the writing myself. Um, I do play a lot of solo shows, but I also have a, a backup band for, for a lot of shows. So. Describe your sound. Um, lately, it's been called sort of uh, haunting folk pop. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, but it's it's all piano driven. Yeah, I do a little bit of guitar, but it's it's heavily piano based. So, would a uh, Tori Amos be an influence? Would a Kate Bush be an influence? Kate Bush, actually, someone just wrote a review about my EP and sort of drew some comparisons from Kate Bush. It's not a bad thing. Yeah, um, yeah, I would say uh, people say sort of a along the lines of a girl version of Patrick Watson, maybe. That's good too. Yeah. <laughs> well, and you're not nearly kooky enough to be either Tori Amos <laughs> or Kate Bush. I put the mask on. Right now. <laughs> You um, have been playing a bunch of shows. There must have been some kind of rock star moment where you think to yourself, I can do this for a living. Where did that happen? Yeah, I would say so far, um, well, I played a show in New York for the first time, um, headed down, and then had to book it back really fast and get it to, into Toronto to play the Horseshoe Tavern with Yukon Blonde and a few other bands. And it was just such an awesome two days because the show in New York was amazing and it felt like sort of a benchmark moment to be to be playing down there and actually play a like, successful show down there in like the big C down there. And then I came back and the show was sold out at the Horseshoe and it was just an awesome moment. That, I would say, was the best yet. <laughs> so. Let's look at the other side of the coin. Yeah. <laughs> the worst moment so far. The worst moment so far. Hmm. Sound, uh, sounds like you've been lucky. I, I have been pretty lucky, yeah. I've had, I've, I played uh, the Mod Club once with, uh, I, I won't say who, but <laughs> a sort of Hollywood actor gone musician. Okay. And uh, I was the opener, and, um, and he just, it was so funny, because I saw him, like, sort of stroll in right when I finished my set, and then... And then I get off stage and he was like, that was amazing. <laughs> you, are, you are great. I'm so inspired. And I was like, I saw you. You missed the whole show. I saw you. <laughs> like, but I just kind of was like, no, thanks so much. Like, I'll take it. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> okay, it is now about 1 o'clock on Friday afternoon. We're yeah. uh, more or less halfway through North by Northeast for this year. You still have some shows to play. Um, yeah, I played. Uh, actually played... Uh, my main show on Wednesday night at the Rivoli uh, was a Novato showcase. Novato is the record label that I'm on. Um, but I am playing part of the park series in Trinity Bellwoods Park on Sunday. Um, actually, it's been going on all weekend and a ton of people have been coming out. It's outside. It's really nice and it's just all acoustic sets. Um, so I'm playing there at four on Sunday and it Excellent. should be good. Yeah. Well, good luck with everything. Thanks so much. And thanks for coming yeah, down. Nice all right. to meet you. Thank you. <laughs>